Hi Aries, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general weekly message from December 18th until the 24th, 2017. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private reading, all the information is down below in the description box. So let's just get started, Aries. Okay, your first card is the Harfon. Now the Harfon is known as the Major Arcana. Um, it is also known as the universe himself, um, kind of thing, herself. Um, I feel that with this card, though, and according to this spread, I feel that he is, in, it's definitely in regards to a new beginning, in regards to a, a fresh new start in love, okay? And I feel that you've been a little stressed out about this. This is the Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords is known as mental anguish. Uh, you can't sleep at night. You know, it's just really troublesome for you. And I feel that the Hierophant is right next to that saying just wait just wait you know it's like spirits like we have your back we know what's going on his if you take notice to his one hand it's just like peace out you know kind of thing it's like just relax everything's okay we know that you're a little stressed out about wanting this new beginning in love okay and right next to this ace of cups is the full card so there's definite something that you want to manifest with the magician here right next to this full card here you've been thinking with your thoughts and in regards to a, a brand new start in love and that you have this full card here for this brand new start okay in regards to love definitely okay so this has taken a lot of your patience okay it's been coming in because you have the temperance card here this is known as the patience card they're making me focus in on this water water to me is emotion so you may be a little emotional about waiting about being patient in regards to this love relationship because it's kind of giving you quite a little bit of um mental anguish a little bit but spirit's here spirit is definitely here saying just wait it's coming for you kind of feeling okay I feel that this uh, relationship is coming in at a slow pace because you have the Knight of uh, Wands here. Wands are like he's holding on to this one wand ready for this passionate new beginning, this new start, okay, in regards to love. But it is a night, so I feel that this mental anguish that you've been dealing with, that you've been patiently waiting for, has been taking its time, okay. The overall energy is the Five of Cups, so you've been definitely feeling this not feeling the love kind of thing that you need some I, I took two cards for that actually and the high priestess so I feel that somebody needs to be rushing in you have this knight of swords here he's known as the communicator he's holding his swords swords are mental energy meaning that um I, I just heard like I want to clear the air kind of feeling but that it's taking a long time the night you have two nights here so yes that makes total sense with this patience card here this temperance card okay because I feel that somebody is rushing back but it's not as fast as you would like and I feel that with this card um, with the overall energy she's known as this as the, as the secret keeper so I feel that something needs to be opened up there's also they're also pointing these out the two poles here so to me um, with your energy in the center I feel like you need to make a decision uh, when there's two poles here and then your energy in there that's a decision making card to me so I feel that you need to make this decision about um, you're kind of like in your mind and you need this clarification. Thank you. Um, they're talking and I feel that but it's coming in way too slow. Okay, but I really feel that with this brand new start in regards to love with this ace of cups here that there's going to be some type of communication that you want. Okay, and it's in regards to someone from your past. Now we're not talking like 20 years down the road kind of thing, but I feel it's somebody that you already know that you want to make this reconnection. Thank you. And that it's taking a lot of your uh, patience. Okay. Because because you really can't sleep at night it's really giving you um, a burden kind of feeling in your mind and that you want this you've been you've been manifesting and I feel that the message here for for this uh, spread I truly feel this whenever they have this um, magician card here okay and then you have this mental anguish okay I feel that for this message I feel that spirit is trying I mean spirit is definitely present in this spread with the Hierophant here so I feel that spirit is trying to say because this card was actually right next to the Hierophant so I feel that spirit is trying to say um, you know um, how do I put this nicely 
um, don't have these um, this mental anguish. I know it's easier said than done, but I feel that spirit is trying to guide you into saying to get out of your mind kind of thing, to not be so upset that it's coming. It's, you know, just wait for it. Like, peace out kind of thing. Thing. Um, I can never talk like my teenagers, but yeah, and it's just kind of like because when you have this mental anguish, you um, people tend to that's like negative energy, and when you have negative energy, only negative comes to you, kind of thing. I know it sounds warped, but that's the way it is. There's if you turn it around and you think positively more, you're manifesting, and then if you think positively, good things happen for you. So I feel that that's the definite message that spirit wants you to know Aries to get out of your mental anguish and try really hard with a lot of patience to turn your my mom used to say turn your frown upside down and that's what they're bringing to my attention they want you to be happy they want you to think positively it, it be right next to this new uh, this full card here that's a new start I feel that they want you to manifest the, um, in your thoughts about what this new beginning would be like in regards to what this brand new beginning in love would be like and to think more positively because I feel that it is coming in okay because you have the the eight of wands which is fast communication fast movement I think it's more fast communication than anything in regards because it's right above um, or right below this ace of uh, cups here and I feel that in order to have this new beginning there's going to be some type of communication okay and it's kind of ironic because right um oops sorry they're they're like dodging these wands are fierily passionately dodging right at the six of cups card on my table so I feel that this communication is going to be going to someone or coming in from someone um I feel it's more coming in um in regards to someone who you already know because the knight of swords here is that truth it's that clarification is that communication but it is a knight so knights are very and you have two knights so unbelievable slowness okay i definitely feel that and that explains why the temperance card because you're needing a lot of your patience okay and that it's really starting to really or has been really affecting your mind kind of feeling okay but please know that spirit knows what's going on okay and they're like it's okay it's okay it's like calm you know be calm it's going to happen you know relax kind of feeling but yeah definitely i feel that's the definite message here is to try your hardest to uh, turn that frown upside down like my mom used to say and to think positively because when you think positively positive things happen for you but definitely. So I realize this is not going to resonate with everyone, but I sure hope that um, it does. And that um, I hope that it helps somebody out there uh, for Aries. You guys have a great week. Please subscribe if you haven't already and have a great week and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.